Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rizat Graphics. In this tutorial, you will learn to create a simple falling letters animation in After Effects. I learned this technique in Macromedia Flash 5. Anyway, let's see the preview. Without wasting any more time, let's get started. Open Adobe After Effects. Then create a new composition. I am calling it Falling Letters Animation. Set the resolutions to 1920 by 1080 pixels. 30 frames per second. And set the duration to 10 seconds. Go to the File menu, then import the blank paper image. Drag and drop the paper image into a composition. I am going to use this dummy text, but you can use any text you want. Then select the type tool from the toolbar, and create a text box just like this. Right click here, then paste the text, let me adjust the image size. I just want to show you an example, but you can create a nice animation. Perfect. Lock the image layer. Go under the text properties. Click this little arrow button, then choose character offset. Go under the animator one, then under the range selector, then add a keyframe on offset. Change the value to negative 100%. Go forward to 3 seconds. Then change the offset value to positive 50%. Go under the advanced. Change the shape from square to ramp down. Change the ease high value to 100%. Also, change the ease low value to 100%. Turn on the randomize order. Change the random seed to 100. Let's see if our animation is working or not. As you can see, our animation is not working. So, let's fix this. Click this little add button, go to property, and choose position. Then add a keyframe on position property. Go to 3 seconds forward. Then change the Y position to 1500. Select all keyframes. Right click. Keyframe assistant. Choose easy ease. Let's preview it again. Cool. Again click on add button, go to property. Now I am going to add the rotation property. Add a keyframe. Go forward to 5 frames. Change the rotation to 1 round. Go forward to 3 seconds. Then change the rotation to 5 rounds. Drag the offset keyframe to 5 seconds. Looks good to me. Select the text layer and press Ctrl D to make it duplicate. Hide the second text layer. Go to the first text layer properties. Then under the text. Then delete the first animator, we don't need it. Go to the effects and presets. Search the effect typewriter. Drag and drop to the text layer. Keep the text layer selected. Then press U to reveal all keyframes. Then drag the second keyframe to 5 seconds. Make sure, your time cursor is at 5 seconds. Go to the edit menu, then click split layer. Then delete the top layer. 
Now, unhide the second text layer. Then drag it to start from 5 seconds. Let's see the final output. Looks perfect to me. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you do have any questions, or if anything that is unclear, please leave a comment. I will respond as soon as possible. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching. Good luck.